What is that? Radical pile of long dead creatures frozen in crippled state of disfor deformation scars as the sea floor. Is that- Oh god, that's just- Ah, that- no. Like a tooth growing inside a tumor. Ah, that's just disgusting. Hello guys, welcome to another water. This is part 11. And it feels like we are about to end the game. I know it says 42%, but it's basically trying to collect everything and finding what is or is not in the ocean. But story wise, it feels like the end. So, if I remember correctly, uh, we are trying to find something. I don't know. But we have scanned and earned cool pictures like last time. Just don't remember what they were. I think, was this one? Yes. We got cool, amazing sketches. We scanned everything. Now let's check the dive map and see where to go. So I think there is a new place we're supposed to explore. Yep, the deep vents. So look how how much we have explored so far. I, I just cannot believe it. So, I don't know what's wrong with my mouth right now, but it's behaving quite unwell. So yes, let's go straight to the deep vents. We don't know what's there, but we sure will find out. We are almost at the hydro thermal vents, 3 kilometers down. This one has to be close to the Zeus range. Three? I can hear the plate cracking. Somehow we are manipulating uh, manipulate one's atmospheric pressure of pressure inside the hard suit. If we can make it, if you, if we make it back, we will be setting a strong first record of deep dives on Gliese 666. There's almost nothing in the water column here. No life to speak of, but the ocean mine should be somewhere ahead. That's our target. Whatever monster back I left us, I'm ready. Let's find it. The ocean... I think we're trying to find the artifact. I don't know how to pronounce them. But yeah, that is what they're trying to do. And when it comes to life, she's always wrong, I gotta say. Speakers of iron ore have across across the seafloor, the mark of nearby hydrothermal activity. There's not enough oxygen down here there to be re re rebreeze, so I'm I'm on reserves. The survey data we pull shows the vents running north from here along a, a ridge. Keep moving, we haven't gone long. That is my intention. But I forgot to bring any samples. So we are screwed if there's no life. <laughs> the black plumps of the fluid rise from the crystalline chimney, discolored with yellow sulfur streak. What is that? Incredible, look at this thing. I remember reading from the discovery of hydrothermal vents on Earth centuries ago. Donnelly, Coral, and Van Andel, street geologists, they never expected to find life on in the in that eternal darkness. And yet there it was. Whole ecosystem we never knew were totally there, totally independent of the sun's light. There was imagined to be models of alien ecosystem life in its most extreme form. But until the planet as death proved to be false, to all hu of humanity the universe was dead. Damn back yeah, for keeping this fr place from us, from keeping humanity in the dark. Well, I think not knowing is better. <laughs> the bone pale sand mold surrounds the chimney like great pale of cinnamon ash. So that's basically the towering okay we have to go oh swarm we're 3000 meters down below i think this is probably the lowest we have ever gotten the overhanging shimmer was trapped glasses reflects the twisted shape of the, the strange dead creatures of spine base it's 
this? I don't understand. Where is where is the life? The ecosystem is totally barren. barren. All this mineral, nutrition, heat, and nothing feeds of it. How could this be? Could it be just... Could, could it just be this vent? Let's keep looking. Ooh, darkness. We were a little bit warm right there. But okay. Eons of sedimented black. The seafloor so pale and empty. Oh, another vent. This artificial mine Akari was building down here. What was the end goal? Was Baki hoping to control this whole ecosystem? An entire planetary agriculture alluded to feeding their needs? An ecology manipulated by the possibility of genetic writing? A power stolen from the artifacts? An enslaved planet like Earth? I know now why Maya was so secretive. She knew that if they found out this place again, that they it would be it that would be it for life here. Yeah, because the first time around didn't go well. <laughs> yeah, we tried to destroy it. Can't believe it. Okay, the string tiled and curved rocks sit all around the distorted by tectonic process and stained with material growth. Mineral growth, sorry. Minerals. The surface around these vents are thick with sediment but absent of all life. Even the. Ooh, what is that? Bacterial mats are nowhere to be seen. Let's continue further. Another barren vent. This place has been wiped clean. Something is wrong here. What did they do? I wish I knew. Is it supposed to have life? So deep in the ocean? This beach sand is almost purposely clean. No life has marked its surface in decades. Another stern sits at the edge of the cluttering, following the water with blackened flute, like the darkness bonfire. Dark souls. <laughs> I don't know why I said that. Why are we going in circles? Here, oh sorry. Here away from the vents, pile and piles of distorted cor corpses lie. Their water bone Dusted pale sermon. What happened? Bones? Oh my god, look at these creatures. This this body looks like a process of ossification. The muscles have become bones. Their mutants are extremes. Like cancerous growth, there is no structure to the autonomy. The mind is this what it made is this what is made? This senseless monstrosity. What is that? Radical pile of long dead creatures frozen in crippled state of disform deformation scars the sea floor. Is that oh god that's just ah no, no. this is bones I just nope no thank you The corpse has become a mass of undifferentiated matter with occasional shape of the bone or shell like a tooth growing inside a tumor Ah, that's just disgusting. Avast organic spear towers over the corpses. Its or orna ornate geodesical patterns mirror those of the artifacts. This the mine is huge, but it's silent. It's been silent for decades. This is no cradle of life, it's a grave. Did they fail? Is this all that's left? A broken mind lying in a bed of corpse? They have no idea what they were doing. The arrogance of all this. A whole ecosystem boiled down to nothing. That was lost to us. This are Baikia's crime. Akari, Akari's crime. What a waste. Is there nothing left? We should look inside. Let's do that. Let's do that. I think that really you won't go even okay. I don't know if we're gonna reach the fourth. <laughs> okay, okay. The four thousand mark is very much. Okay. Deep inside the oceanic mine, something flickers in the ruins. Is that an artifact? It survived, or it was born here. Does that mean there's more? It looks dark, 
dormant. Is it alive? Wait, do you hear that? The string is stringing. I can feel. It knows. It knows that we are here. And it's afraid. I understand why. Look what humans did here. I'm sorry. Wait. What? No, no. Come back. I didn't even scan it. No, it's gone. Ah, oh, dang it! We should have. We should be going too. We are running. Do we are running down our oxygen, and it's in a long way back up. Come on. There's nothing left for us here. Dang it! I was like, should I scan it? No, no. Let me get close, idiot mind. Ah, I'm so pissed right now. Is there anything to go back? Okay, okay. Time to go. I'm beginning to ascent. So they're still out there. The artifacts. This is their planet, and we owe them so much. I suppose your planet too, with the mind being a failure, the colony destroyed. You are the, the, its last artifact born here. And now, this is my home too. Mina and Mias. Mine and my, oh sorry. And there's so much left for me to do, so much to study, so much to understand. Our history here is ugly, it's something I, I don't want to be part of. But this planet's future, maybe we can have a part of that. Mia gave everything for the truth. Some radiant part of the artifact changed her, but I hope she knows. Knows that she succeeded. This place is no longer a secret, no longer backyards to control. Thank you, Mia. And thank you to you for staying with me, for guiding me. Together, I think we can make a change, show humanity back as crime, make them accountable. We both carry burdens here, but the past doesn't deny us, doesn't define us. Life continues here, despite everything that happened. I can't find comfort in that. I think I'm going to stay. I don't have anything left out there, but here I have Mia, I have you. And I have a purpose. Someone needs to swim these waters to catalog this world. When I was little, I swam. I swam every day. I could have walked down the ocean and stepped into it without a thought. I lost that degree by degree as the Earth's ocean died. But here, things can be like that once again. These waters can wash all the old ways away. And together, we will see what's left when they do. Four anise. Anise. What's that double dot there? But I seem we have ended this. It is over. It was amazing, guys. I, I I don't know how to explain. Oh, we finished it. This is by far the most amazing story I've done on the channel. Okay, there's after party, but this is no, this is better. I gotta say, it. this is better. This is amazing. Uh, it feels like we always, as humans, destroy everything we find. And it's so sad that we almost destroyed life on another planet just to get something out of it. Okay, special tanks. Yeah, I'm like, bravo guys, bravo whoever made this. You guys deserve a spotlight. Thank you for all the backers who made this game possible. Wow, that's a lot. I, I would assume that there are a lot of people backing this up because it is one hell of a Like, I like it. I really do. And look at those people. So many.
could probably find your name in here. <laughs> Let's uh, look. So it's basically in alphabetic orders. I don't know, I just want to highlight. But yeah, good job, guys. Good job. Made with Unity. Unity. And beyond. <laughs> uh, yep, jump over the age. You guys. You guys did jump over the age and made an amazing game. Let's go back to base and I want to check one last thing before I wrap this up. One tiny thing. Unless there's a story behind it, I do Sinking with Bakia OS, downtime. Hey, we're back. Hey, wake up. You've been out for a while as usual. I've been thinking, we have maybe got a few weeks before someone turns up here. Could be Backash chasing down the transmission signal from there, from this base. Could be someone else entirely passing through their system, pick up my shadow transporter. Whoever it is, we need to be ready. I want to log everything we can, every species, every samples. I want to, I want the walls of data to show the Inhabit in systems to the off-world colony, to Earth. They want to race us. They want to race this place. We are going to show it to everyone together. So let's start studying. There's a whole ocean to go at in a few weeks to do it. Okay, I'm ready. Choose your next dive. Okay, the thing I'm, I came here to do was to read the final crew terminal. Now the real work begins. Whatever was left the oceanic mine, it is dead. Another failed experiment, another biological atrocity to find the humanity's list. But I don't want it to, to define us and our role in this planet. We can't start fresh, I know that. But the artifacts are still here, and that means we can reach them. I want to show them we are curious, we are kind, we are able to live alongside them. There's still so much left to study here, so many questions to answer. But I'm not scared anymore. I'm excited to see what we can achieve in the next time. In the, in the time we have. People come across here soon enough. And when they do, I want to show them what we have found. The evidence of backcast crimes. And what we need to protect. If people can see this place for what it is. A second chance. Then maybe they will want to protect it too. That's what my father believed. And my mother believed. That is, if people could understand what they were losing. That they would want to save it. Let's get to work. Anyways, thank you guys for watching. I really hope you enjoyed this amazing series. And we're supposedly ending it here. And until next game, I suppose. And don't forget to like and subscribe.